So now that we've finished the first module, it's time for your first homework assignment. So uh, once again, the full instructions for this should be contained uh, on the website, but let me give you a quick overview here uh, in a video and let me uh, explain to you how you're going to turn this homework assignment into us. So first of all, the homework assignment that you're going to complete, homework assignment one, is to use Scratch in logo mode, using pen uh, and, and movement, to draw out your three initials. Most people have three initials. If you've got more, go ahead and do more. But what we'd like you to do is basically just draw out with very simple penmanship, uh, very simple block lines, uh, your initials. So my full name is John Ben Schaefer. Um, and so when I click on the green flag here, I draw out my initials JBS. And I mean, the cat jumps around very quickly there. You don't even really see him because I don't have any pauses in there. But that's all that I want, right? And so it doesn't have to be perfect. You don't have to have curves uh, with the, you know, I don't have a curve with the J and a curve with the B. I just did it with block letters. You're welcome to do it with curves. We saw a few minutes ago uh, how to do, uh, how to make you know half circles and things like that using small degrees and turns and so you're welcome to do be as creative with this as you want but we'd like you to make a, a program that creates your three initials and once you're done with that you need to be able to share that with us and so we need to talk about how to go ahead and share that with us there's a couple of ways that you can do this once it's all built and saved within your account you want to be able to save and first of all or share you may notice that there's a share button right up here in the corner right and so always as good as good practice make sure that you do a save now before you do this so that we make any changes that were there uh, get saved out and again my code is hidden off the screen at the moment but then we want to share this and the easiest way is just to click this share button and that will then take me to the project page for this, where I can, and this is what other people basically will see when, and what we will see when you share this with us. It'd bring up a page like this where I can run the program right here uh, in the page. And if you'd like to give some instructions, you know, uh, press the green flag to see my initials or something like that. Uh, if you want to give yourself some, some credit here, so this was written by Ben Schaefer, you can you can do whatever you want as far as filling all this in. Um, you can turn off commenting on the page if you don't want others to be able to look at it and, and comment on it. Although truthfully, I don't think most will, given the nature of this. But but you can just uh, publish this, right? And then if you want to go back to working with it, you can say see inside, and you and you come out to this where you can where you can continue to work on it. Need to point out that when you share something, it's live shared, which means if you continue to edit it. Other people may be seeing your program while you're editing it. So if you break it temporarily, uh, you've shared a broken version with things. So please don't share this with us until you have it all ready to go and you are ready for us to check this in. If when you're done, you'd like to, and it's been graded by us, you'd like to unshare it and not have it out there uh, publicly for people to see, then what you do is you go to my stuff and you can see that here's my homework one. And right now, you know, you'll notice that the other ones have not been shared. So there's the other way to share it is here from my stuff where there's a share button. In mine, homework one is shared. And so if I want to no longer have it shared, I can click the unshare button. Okay. But let's go back and look at sharing one more time. I'm going to share. We're going to go to the main page for this. And what you're going to do then to, sh to share this with me is to submit this URL right here. Once you've shared, you're going to copy and paste this URL, and you're going to use the submission system within Course Builder to uh, submit that URL. And we'll use this to grade this and check it in. And you basically get a, a credit for having it done. When we hit the green flag, do you produce your three initials? Be as creative as you want. Uh, but those are the minimum requirements.